If you've been following our vlogs, you know we just spent the last two days in Dubai, which is in the United Arab Emirates. We are not done exploring this country yet, but today we are actually leaving the UAE to head back to Oman, which is a country that we have already visited. The reason we are doing it this way is because the area we are going to, called Kassab, is actually north of Oman and it is easier to get to from Dubai than from the country of Oman itself. Kassab is geographically separate from Oman. If you look on the map, it is actually on the Persian Gulf in the Strait of Hormuz. And if you were to drive to it from the capital city of Oman, Muscat, you would have to drive through the UAE and it takes nearly six hours. But from Dubai, that drive is only about two and a half hours, which makes it a popular day trip from Dubai. During the drive up, we were treated to spectacular views of the coastline of the Musadam Peninsula. This area is actually known as the Norway of Arabia because of the many fjords out here that are cut out by um, glaciers long, long time ago. Shortly after crossing the border from UAE to Oman, we were at the port where we boarded our cruise for the day. This is a Dao, which is a traditional sailing vessel used in Arab and Indian Ocean countries, um, used to carry anything from heavy items to fruits and vegetables. But today, it is our tour boat. This is the craziest jellyfish bloom we have ever seen. They're so cool. They're actually really heavy and you can totally touch them and not get stung. As far as we know, there are only supposed to be two places in the world where you can swim with stingless jellyfish and that's in Palau and also in Indonesia. We had done it in Palau before, but we had no idea that this is something you could have done in the Middle East. This was totally the highlight of this trip and we're so shocked that it's not even advertised anywhere. So some of you might have recognized the name Strait of Hormuz when I mentioned it earlier. Um, we were sailing in the Strait of Hormuz, this is part of it. Um, when we were there in April, this region as you can tell was just idyllic, beautiful. Um, you couldn't even tell that there's anything going on here. We had no idea how important this region was to the world. Um, so it surprised us when we got home and we learned about all of the conflicts. Hopefully this area is still just as peaceful because it was just beautiful. that we're in India or we're in Dubai. <laughs>